book, but let's build Hogsmeade. Part 7. The Three Broomsticks, Part 3. And today we are going to do the interior to the Three Broomsticks. I am hoping we're going to get the Three Broomsticks finished off today, but I'm not so sure we will. I just had a look at the interior on my world to see how much there is, and there's a lot more than I thought. Oh yes, a lot more. So this is going to be a very bitty one when it comes to editing, so we'll only put one item up once, I suspect. Um, I would put it all outside the way we do sometimes, but... Oh, we have some out there, but it's going to be interior stuff. Odds are I'm going to forget those, so we're going to do the inventory as we go along. Okay, so let me grab... Right, hmm, okie dokie. So, for our equipment, we're going to want some chairs. So for our chairs, we use stairs. We'll go for oak stairs. And we're going to have the slabs too. So we're going to go for some oak slabs. And some trap doors. Again, oak. We want some fences. And we'll go for spruce. Some lanterns and some chains. We've also got a fireplace at the back there, so we want some stone bricks, some stone brick stairs. And we're going to want some campfires. And we are going to need a few more bits for this level. Uh, quite a few more bits for this level. Um, and there's three floors. So yes, I am hoping to get this done, but as I say, this may take two. Okay, so I think we'll start off with the lights. Let's get some light in here. Um, doing the fireplace, we'll start that. Oh. Okay, so. Ba -ba -ba. Who was that? Where are you? So we're going to go. So we're going to keep starting at our double doors over here. Um, that's our reference point, starting point, so you can all tell where I am and what I'm doing where. Because it gets easy to get, to get turned around, doesn't it? So this wall, we're going to have a nice big fireplace. Um, is there a middle? I'd say that was the middle. That looks middle. We don't have to count. Two, three, four. Two, three, one, two, three. Gosh, it feels like ages since I've played this. It wasn't. Sweetie. 
gosh, what's going on today, people? As soon as I've hit record, everybody's come out and say, I want to talk to you. You couldn't do it before I press record. Oh, no, no, no. Stairs on that one, I think. Here we go. Nice big fireplace. Change out underneath. Like so. Right, lights, 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 lights. I think we're going to need some in the middle here. Um, it would help if we could see. So let's just put those there for the time being. Right, so we've got some vision up there now so what we're gonna do is I mean, if you want to measure this you can so we've got a group of four okay and then we're gonna put that that side I'd say that's looking about central So we're going to put two lots of chains down and then we're going to put a fence on top of those. side out a little bit more and then we're going to put a lantern on the ends there take away that one take away that one we're going to do the same over on this one, I think. Can we get away with that? Um, unknown. Because we've got staircases in, that, in the way. Let's put one over here. And if we have to move it, we'll move it. For fairly confident we're going to get one on this one because we have got a staircase but it's right on the end there. Um, okay, so let's go for another one. Let's put some light on. It's a small one, this one. But we're still going to use four. At least I know that's definitely central there. Uh, but I think it should come this way.
knew I was going to do that. We'll fix that in a bit. Okay, nice and light now. Okay, so let's throw in some tables and chairs. So I think we'll put in some here and some here. Put some over here. I think we're going to put some corner ones in. Staircase in, I think, actually. At least then we know. Okay, so we're going to make it identical. So we're going to come over here and it is one, two, three, four on the fifth block over. So it's one, two, three, four, five. It's one, two, three, two and three, and we're going to put a staircase in here. See, it's a good job, I think, because that table's in the way. We'll move you over. Yes, I think we'll do the tables last, because then we can fit them in wherever we want. Three blocks wide, so this is going to go all the way to the ceiling. Daisy, I need to find my rhythm today. always move that over if you prefer it might actually be better moving that over a couple of blocks in fact I think we will do that in a bit I think we're going to put a torch on either side of those, like 
that up a bit. That's better. One stuck ice scaring up. Ding ding, floor two. Right, what we're going to do next is we're going to change a little bit of equipment. So we're going to go for the cobblestone. We need normal cobblestone. We're going to change the stone bricks and the cobblestone stairs. Yes, I think that's what we're going to do. Where's the best place to measure this bit? Okay, I don't think it matters this one because it doesn't go upstairs. What we're going to do is we're going to come up here and we're going to put in almost the same level as those chains. Probably knock some of this out in a moment. I'm just lining things up. out there. And we don't need those, do we really? Because we're right next to the light. Okay, so we're now going to get rid of the cobblestone. We're going to get some, I think, that is, what is that? Oak log. Oak log. I think we want some spruce, don't we? Because we've poked a hole in things. Don't need that anymore. If we still got the slabs, we do. We still got the trap doors, goody good. gonna change the mud. We're gonna change the mud, the packed mud for the time being. Oh we're done with these. So we'll go for the mud bricks and the mud wall. So I want to move this a couple of blocks over. I'm gonna put it on this window instead. I forgot the mud stairs. Change the mud stairs.
I'm going to go over to this end now. Whoops. And you want to go roughly in the center, but come one block away and we're going to put in an oak log. The oak log is going to go all the way to the top. And we're going to poke holes around that. We will close up what we can when we're done. We're going to use our slabs. Put one there. I'm going to go up half a block each time. a block each time okay let's see there so how much of this can we get away with covering up I'm thinking there and there well not there but maybe we can put in a slab so let's try our spruce slabs we're done with the oak now no we're not actually do is we're just gonna put some trapdoors at the sweetie around it Dun, 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 dun. So over this side. go spiral staircase to the second floor okay so I think down here is more or less done so we're just gonna go back and grab that oak slab and we can put in our chairs now because we know what space we've got so we can put a nice big one in this corner here for big groups of people
<laughs> Bit wobbly today. And three. Okay, and I think we'll put another one. I think we'll put a couple coming out of the wall. in as many as you want now wherever you want I'm putting these completely random feels like it should have more seats on that one Whoop. same over here Whoop. We do like the corner ones. I think we can put another one over here. one in front of the fire. Put in as many as you want. Okay, so we're going to put some decorations in. So we want, we're going to risk putting a painting or two about. Um, and we're going to get some heads. We now have a pickling head. I don't know when we got that. I never noticed us getting that. Uh, but if you haven't noticed either, we now have a pigling head. Uh, we want some chains too. If I remember correctly, we do have three heads by the door. I think. I think it was this one. I'm sure I remember seeing. Sweetie. best we're gonna get. I'm sure there's three heads there. They say thick heads or something like that. They call them. So there's our three heads. Three broomsticks, three heads. Very shaky today. My little one has decided to camp out behind me. So every time he moves, I get a foot in the back. Oh. Okay, let me just double check. Oh, we want to put some... There. We'll put a couple of paintings about. Again, we're not going to go nuts. Just one or two here and there. 
because they do cause the lag and we don't like the lag. Oops, a daisy. put a few heads about because we can and it makes it look weird which it's meant to be and I think that's it for this room now If you want to add more decorations you certainly can okay so now we're gonna go up the stairs and we have one two one two three four blocks okay where are we going up the stairs we go Okay, and we're going to put down one, two, three, four. That's the ceiling to this one. One there too. knocking out what we can, open it up a bit so that's the lighting Okay. 
Okie dokie. Um, let's grab some lanterns so we can have a look about. So again, I'm not going to keep putting stuff that we've already used up on the screen. This is going to take an age to edit as it is. This is going to be a nightmare to edit. Um, so the trying to save ourselves some work. Sometimes these can take hours to edit. I think the record is something like six and a half hours for one, just for one tutorial. Right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's go upstairs on the Xbox and see what we do. I'm already up there. Okay, so is that in the centre? It is more or less. Let's see, okay, so we're just gonna grab some glowstone and our trap doors back. We want the oak trap doors. So we're going to go into the mid, oh, and our log, oak log. I thought I already had that, but I don't. I'm going to go into the centre there. Take this all the way across. To make it look like a nice fancy beam. we'll go with every five we might tweak some things if we need to so we're just gonna put one going across there and then every five so we've got one two three four five one two three four five One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Hang on. No, no, no. We want a total of five inside them. Yes. That uh, is kind of important or our glowstone's not going to go. So it's on the sixth one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Silly me. It's one, two, three, four, five, six. So on the sixth one. One, two, three, four, five, and six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So three, four, five, six. Okay, and we're going 
going to bring that up that's going to continue up so I have to poke some holes around that one might have to break up to beam a bit see where we end up okay and then halfway on these in the middle block we're going to put our old glowstone. We're not going to, but yes, we can take all that all the way. So in the middle of those, that's why it was important we had a gap of five, because then there is a middle. And then we're going to put trapdoors on the side. Again, we might have to tweak that a bit for our staircase. think these ones matter which way up they go I can't see any difference anyway so has everybody been playing with the new add-ons there's a load of uh, add-ons in the marketplace for free I can give you furniture and dragons I love the dragons However, they all do cause lag and quite a bit of it. So make sure you use them sparingly if you do use them. So we don't really see up here either, so this level can be anything you want. You don't have to do this, you can put whatever you want because we don't see this. still give off the same amount of light just takes the glareness off them I suppose so this is just the second floor there's a third floor 
The third floor is Rose Murta's private rooms. And we do the bit where we see Fudge and McGonagall come in to talk about Sirius and Harry. That's on the third floor. We don't really see much inside the three broomsticks other than that. Be able to get rid of these now. Okay, am I right in thinking that that goes all the way through this level too? It does, so we're just gonna go and grab some more oak. We're gonna grab the oak stairs. Uh, the oak plat slabs. We're going to keep the trapdoors. Keep, keep, keep those just in case. Uh, yes, we'll keep the rest of those just in case. Okay. So where's our thing going? Here it is. Okay, so let's take that off because I think we're going to continue up. each time okay so we're gonna have to get rid of that one that one most likely that one No, with spruce, isn't it? Spruce. Put a spruce slab in there. I think that would work. So spruce slab on there. Yes, we can get up there now. Third floor, ding ding. And there's another staircase yet. Trap doors. No, it's not going to let me put that up there. So we'll put it up there. from falling down um, although we need that one open because that's where you get off <laughs> okie dokie so we've got another staircase over here let's see where that one goes exactly okay so we know So three blocks in from there, 
so let's just find our home. One, two, three. And then, depends how wide is that. One, two, three, four, five. That's five blocks, and we've got one, two, three, four. So let's take another layoff there. And I think we're going to swap to spruce stairs. One, two. Yep, get rid of those. And then these also go to the ceiling. Okay, so we're going to have to punch some more holes in things. Also going to build a wall down. So I'm going to take that off there. But I think we'll move that side too. It's a bit better that way, doesn't it? Just building a wall down the side a bit. Okay, so we've got slabs, we've got stairs, we're just going to grab some, no we won't, we're just going to stick with the trap doors I think. Okay, so now, we're just going to throw in some tables and chairs. So these are going to be like big party tables or conference chairs. They don't have to match the same colour. So these are parties, large gatherings. Same over here, I think it's just a couple of tables. Yep. Okay, so we're going to put some... Don't quite sit right there, does it? So we'll put some in front there.
turn these into nice window seats. Okay, so then it's just add your own decorations, add a couple of paintings, don't get carried away, um, add some plant pots, add some flowers, add some um, candles if you want to, it's up to you. You can put whatever decorations in you want, you can put another fireplace in at that end if you really wanted to. Move this table up along, put in another fireplace. Um, we can squeeze in another table in here. It's entirely up to you what you think should be in the pub go in the pub. You can use different style chairs, mix it up a bit, use some bamboo, use crafting tables as, ta as the tables, uh, you can use barrels as tables, just put some chairs around them. Go nuts, go do whatever you want. It's entirely up to you. Third floor, third and final floor. How are we for time though? Oh, we're on an hour. But we have had a few interruptions. So I say we can get away with doing the third floor. Okay. So we're gonna grab doll. Spruce doll. Get rid of the chains. So we're going to put some double doors there, which means we need to build around it. Okay, so at this end of things, right, I think we're going to put in a wall. I'm going to put in a wall around about there. Double doors in there. Okay, so we're going to focus on this side. See, this is going to be her private chambers. That's her personal bedroom. Can we get away with it? We can. We can open that up a bit more. Let's 
so fudge and we're gonna go look gonna come up here so they're not gonna get a nice view of her bedroom because that would just be mean okay so we're gonna grab some more equipment we're gonna grab some barrels because it's a pub there's gonna be a lot of barrels about um, we're gonna grab some chests gonna grab some carpet what color shall we go for what colors rose matter what do you think of with rose matter um, kind of want to avoid Hogwarts colors because we use those a lot <laughs> let's go for something different I'm gonna say pur purple and pink we're gonna keep the lanterns what else is down there? I'm gonna grab some bookcases. <laughs> um, what else do we want? She's also got quite a bit in here. Wow. Okay, Santa, you squeeze quite a lot in here. We're going to go for some bamboo chairs to be a little bit different. Um, but we're not going to use the bamboo slab because that's going to be too much. I think we'll, we'll use some smooth sandstone, make something different. Okay. Fences. Grab some fences. We're going to go for the nether brick fence. And we've got carpet. Okay. That will do for the time being. There's much, much more. Right, so we're going to put in a bit of a rug here. so they can all wipe your feet especially fudge he's stepped in some poop so he certainly needs to wipe his feet okay we've got uh, so we're gonna throw some barrels not there we're gonna throw some barrels around here Cases. Um, we can put some bookcases along. Nope, wrong one. Bookcases along the back there. So that's where McGonagall sits. fireplace in there in a moment there's another one of these isn't there because she has a couple of stands because we see McGonagall putting her glass on it she's going to be a very colourful person Some lanterns up on there. <laughs> We're gonna grab some smooth quartz. We're gonna grab 
some smooth quartz stairs. Didn't need the chests after all, did we? Maybe in the next room. Buttons. We're going to go for some stone buttons. We're going to go for some furnaces. Some spruce trap doors. Flower pots. This is going to take an age to edit. Oh, what's that? Torch flower seeds. Oh, and we want some stone pressure plates. Okay, so what we're going to do is she's going to make her a bit of a kitchen here. ceiling up here too. Oh, we'll come to that in a moment then. I think we'll leave it. Yeah, we, we'll cap it off in a bit. Okay, so we're just going to grab some, we're just going to grab some polished blackstone stairs. I'm just grabbing things at random here to be quite honest. If we're going to put in another table, we can make the table whatever you want. We went with the orange, didn't we? So I'm just grabbing things at random, I'm not really planning it. Her dinner table. <laughs> okay, so we're just gonna grab some planks then to, to top off the ceiling. We're gonna grab some, oh, the spruce, I think. I'm gonna go above there. We should give it one more height. neater doesn't it okay almost done on this side I'm gonna grab some campfires some stone bricks stone brick stairs and which we forgot downstairs iron bars going to be a small one but we know she does have one Change those 
out the dead blocks. Yep, that's better. Okay, so this room's done now. So she's got one room left to do, and that's her bedroom and bathroom. We're just going to run downstairs. All the way downstairs. Because I forgot to put the iron bars here too. Go back upstairs. Okay, so what have we got on this side of things? This is the last bit now of this building. And then we're done. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to grab some spruce planks and some spruce slabs. And what we're going to do is we're going to cap this off. straight along there and we're going to put our door where our door's gone there it is spruce door there Okay, in here we can grab some quartz again, the smooth quartz stairs, um, oak trap door, grab our oak trap door again. Bucket of water. This is going to be a bathroom and a hopper. And I've just realised I've forgotten something else downstairs too. Let's put that in. It's, we want a cauldron on top of those fires. Okay, so Maz Murta has a nice little bathroom here, right by the window so she can have a nice little lay in there and flush everybody I get the sense Rose Murta won't care about that though okay so over here we're going to put um um baba uh. We forgot the quartz blocks. Smooth quartz blocks. Thanks there. Cap that off. Now 
it's a bathroom for a resmata. So we're just going to grab some spruce slabs and some ladders. Grab some wool for the bed. What colour shall we make it? Shall we match what we've already got? Some carpet for the pillows. I don't know why I've got two colours. I don't need two colours. We'll go for the purple. So I think the pink might be a bit bright. a block half a block higher I want it to be on the top side of a block so we can put things on it So we're going to grab some barrels, hopefully this will be the last lot, I say that every time and it never is, some chests, some bookcases, some end rods and what shall we go for? thinking redstone block of redstone so we're going to put some barrels about up here this is going to be more storage for her because as I say it is a pub chests about. I'm going to put some about here too. Get some bookcases. like there with redstone on it let's get rid of that don't really need that <laughs> and I think that is it for this bit can't see anything else. Um, we could grab some lanterns. I just throw some lanterns on there. Nice and bright now. Let's cap that bit off there. Thank you. 
Okay. And that is that. That is the three broomsticks complete. I was a bit worried we weren't going to get to do that today. So again, as we don't really see a great deal of it, so you can do more or less whatever you want. Cauldrons, cauldrons. tables in put more decorations if you wish to as I say we don't really see a great deal of it so you, you have got a little bit of liberty to play about with it um, and put what you're wanting really and that's it for this one let's clean up a bit so next week we are going to do house another house we have a few styles of house so we're going to do another house So apparently this house I credited to Mads. Apparently Mads followed a tutorial from somebody else. Um, uh, she followed a tutorial by Blue Nerd apparently. So this is Blue Nerd's house. So I have left a link on the description for this house for his house too. So as it does kind of feel like I kind of pinched that and I didn't mean to. But it's a bit late now because you've all seen it. You've all done it. I was not aware. Um, so in the description of the house, I have left a link for his tutorials for his house. He's probably done a better job of it than I did. It's not as long as mine, that's for sure. Probably done this a lot easier. <laughs> Okie dokie. So next time we're going to do another house. Um, where should we put the house? I don't know yet. Um... We're making it up as we go along a little bit, really. The order of things. Let's see, where did I put it on here? Okay, so that's Honey Dukes, I think. Yes, that's Honey Dukes. Ah, and next to that is Zonko's. And then we have a house next to Honey Dukes. Honey Dukes is quite big. Okay, so we will probably put our other house. Where are we going? Maybe down here. We'll put it next to this one, I think. Um, and then we... As I say, if you know your copy and paste commands, you can copy and paste these houses as many times as you want. So you could do that house over and over and over again and scatter them about up there, which is what we will do. Um, I will have the lovely centaur come in and have her copy paste some of these for us and just plunk them about. Uh, but we have got a few different styles to do first. Uh, we've got a windmill and a farm. All the general things that you would typically find in a village. So if Honey Dukes is going to go here, the next house really should go, and the Zonkos is going to go there. So we'll put a house on that side, I think. So then after we've done Honey Dukes, the next house can go after Honey Dukes. That, that's a plan, I think. And then we could probably copy that one after that one too. Yes. I think we'll do that. So the next house is going to go along here. Look at the mess the animals are making. I think I need to turn my tick speed back up. Now the tick speed is the speed that things grow and disappear. So if I turn my tick speed back up to 1, which is where it should be, then, whoops, okay, I'm not sure if I've turned that on or off now, 
all that grass should start growing back. But it does mean your maze is going to might start disappearing. But we're out of range of the maze, so hopefully not. Okay, so that's it for me for today. Next time is a house. Who knows how long that's going to take? Two, maybe three. The last house took two. So these are definitely taking much longer than I expected them to. But what can you do? There's nothing else you can do. Okay then guys. So check out the links in the description for other tutorial series such as Hogwarts, Quidditch, Pitch, Dermstrang Ship, Hogsby Train Station. Can you just see that over there? Yay! Um, there is also links to PayPal and Cash App should anybody fancy leaving a tip. It's always very much appreciated. And there is also a link to the Potter's Nights nice Discord server. That's our server. Uh, that's where me and Centaur are. And many others if you need any help, if you have any questions, just, just want to show us your bills. We're always there. There's always somebody about. Um... We are streaming live every Tuesday and Saturday. We are building Azkaban in survival. We are attempting to build Azkaban in survival. We die a lot. <laughs> um, so come check us out there, 7 p.m. UK time. And that's it for me for today. Until next time, guys, take care of yourselves. Like and subscribe.